it's so close. Oh, it looks like it should. Yes. Hello and happy lockdown day or months as it may turn out. But I've been in lockdown now for 22 days. The boredom is kicking in. Days are just a concept to me now and time feels like it doesn't quite exist. So I thought it would be fun if I pulled out this microscope that I've been storing up for a rainy day and I thought it would be good to have a look at things around the flat after I've built it. So let's see how hard it can be. So it comes with all the pieces ready to be pushed out and step one, push out all the pieces. The bit that's got the lens already has fallen out to the side. Ugh. I don't want to break anything. Okay. Piece number one with a lovely splinter. I have never been one for DIY, but when the project presents itself so nicely. So I've not been particularly active during these self-isolation days. Um, I think the government advice is to go for a walk a day. I've been going for like a walk a week, which I'm taking as a success. Um, I don't live in a particularly busy area, but it's also not really that quiet. So if I do go on the street, I'm probably likely to be kind of close to someone. So I've just been uh, staying indoors apart from the odd trip to the shops. But I have had some very successful shopping trips. Um, I found mint chocolate chip ice cream at the butchers, a very exciting find. And um, oh yes, I got everything together to make pancakes. So I had a pancake day yesterday. Oh. Another piece with a big splinter in it. Oops. Let me just de splinter these. Lethal. Okay, so the big ones seem to be the ones that are stuck in the best. I'm assuming these are like the sides, like the big sides of the microscope. But... Okay. okay, now I have all the pieces out. I should be ready to assemble. Okay, so I think I've got this piece, this little one. Big one. Oh, that slots in. This. Oh, yeah, this one. And then we lock all in place with this. Forky. I think that's the stage adjuster done. Okay. Oh, this is getting complicated. Yep, this looks like it's gonna clip in. It clipped, okay. That sound is good. Clipping in, yes. Oh yeah, it's gonna click, it's gonna click. Okay, that's in. I can feel the splinters going into my hands. This is needing sanded, but I don't have time for that. Okay, another piece done. Oh, oh, it got complicated. Okay, yeah, yes, the stage can be adjusted here, perfect, okay, and then we need the twiddler, oh, okay, yeah, so there's little holes in here so that it can be moved up and down the stage, so it will flip this, oh, I broke it, right, let's reconstruct this, DIY is not my strongest subject. Okay, 
Now I need to close up the other side with this one that looks like the other side to slot in. Okay, I think we're getting somewhere. Okay, I'm feeling it. Right, so, so we have like a stage and then an adjuster for the stage going up and down. Okay, now this needs to be held together, so I think that's what all of these other pieces are for. Oh no. Okay, it slots in, but not all the way. I don't think this is how anyone envis 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 envisioned it. Yes. No, I need to, I need to go back. I did this wrong. Oh, I know what I did. I put this bit in first. This doesn't fit. Oh dear. Okay, it slots in. There we are. Just needs to wiggle in. Or just force it in. Just to go to start with. Oh, okay. We made it. Then you have this bit to go up here. I'm sure of it. Okay, and then the two final pieces look like this one yes so close oh it looks like it should yes here and i made a microscope okay let's find things to look at under the microscope so pretty Okay, so the first problem was I didn't have a slide, so I've DIY'd myself a little microscope slide. So I just cut out this little plastic sheet and it's working as a microscope slide, otherwise everything just falls off. a bunch of random stuff and I think the microscope did a pretty good job for being a freebie I made myself so yeah I also had a fruit and veg box delivered which was maybe the highlight of my week so there is a local fruit and veg place that is delivering I got the smallest one but there's actually a lot in there so so this is the box I think it's pretty big so it was only 11 pounds but I was pleasantly surprised pleasantly surprised pleasantly surprised Three hours later. I just got into the fruit and veg box and the beans are moldy and I only got it yesterday. I'm so sad. I'm gonna try and salvage the ones that are not covered in mold, but that's so annoying. I think the rest of it looks good. I hope. Okay, so I was upset, but I have an idea. I'm gonna put the moldy beans under the microscope and See what they look like. <laughs> They're gonna be put to use. Call your family, enjoy lockdown, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.